somebody praise her. Somebody praise Are you celebrating? Somebody watching somebody praise her. Somebody watching somebody praise
that a man who laid down his life, it is because of his love. Hallelujah. How many of you are celebrating the love of Christ? I'm in love with you for real. Because I'm among you when you select them. You get to see the deal. Oh, my rock you call it then. And then you make an extra move. I give you your life on the wallet tree. What if I got a you? Love you, love you, love you. I love you when you take my life. And I love the way you pull your mind on me. Now I realize that I'm not love you because you have to me. The love of me is not going to go. That's why I'm going to let you go. That's why I say. For your mercy never fails me. 
in all my days. I'll be held in your hands. Somebody lift up your hands. From the moment that I wake up until I take Jesus, I will sing of the good
for saving me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you.
Can you lift up your beautiful hands and shout, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say it louder, say it like a mass choir. Thank you, Jesus. Say it like you mean it. Thank you, Jesus. There is no love greater than this, that a man will lay his own life for his friends. What a privilege. And privilege to know Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Take your Bible, Matthew 28. In the next one hour, we are done with this service. It's a communion service celebrating the Good Friday, the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Please stand to your feet. Take your Bible. Every time we read the Word of God, stand to your feet. Except you have a waste problem, you are crippled, you are lame. You can't work. So we'll be believing God. I don't know whether that man there is a crippled man. Tell him if he's a crippled man. We'll be believing God for miracle for him today. Amen. <laughs> you know, they said all lizards are laying down. You don't know the one with stomach problem. Amen. Happy Good Friday. Matthew 28, I read from verse 1. In the end of the Sabbath, as it began to dawn towards the first day of the week, came Mary Magdalene and the other Mary to see the sepulchre. And behold, there was a great earthquake, for the angel of the Lord descended from heaven and came and rolled back the stone from the door and sat upon it. Wow! The stone that was obstacle for Jesus was rolled away and became a platform to deliver message. Yes. Yes, sir. Mashata. The stone they used in blocking Jesus from not coming out. The stone that was meant to be obstacle the Bible says an angel came from heaven, rolled away the stone, sat on the stone. The stone became a platform. Let's see the message the angel will preach from that platform. His countenance was like lightning and his raiment white as snow. And for fear of him, the keepers did shake and became as dead men. Hmm. And the angel answered and said unto the women, Fear not ye. Look at his message. Look at the message of the angel who turned the obstacle, the stone, into a platform to preach message. Your obstacle is about to become a message for your message. Yeah. Look at what he said to them. He said, Fear not ye, for I know that ye seek Jesus which was crucified. True. Verse 6. He is not here. He is not here. For he is risen, as he said. Come, see the place where the Lord lay. Verse 7. And go quickly, tell. Go and tell. Go quickly, tell. This is his message. Go and tell. The gospel is about going to tell what you have seen. Yes, sir. Go, tell. Go and tell his disciples that he is risen from the dead. And behold, he goeth before you into Galilee. There shall ye see him. Lo, I have told you. That's his message. Verse 8. And they departed quickly 
from the sepulchre with fear and great joy and did run to bring his disciples. Well, may the Lord bless the reading of his word. Amen. Holy Spirit, breathe upon your people. Breathe upon this church once again. Spirit of the living God, glorify Jesus again. Thank you, Father. Jesus' mighty name. Please be seated. I want to speak to you briefly. The birthday of Christianity. The birthday of Christianity. Somebody shout amen. amen. The birthday of Christianity. Now, the most important message in all this, go tell. I don't believe that Jesus resurrected. I know he resurrected. I don't just believe, I know he's a risen Jesus. I know that he resurrected. I, I know he's no longer in the grave. I don't just believe, I know. I know it. The angel said, I've seen with my eyes. Go, tell them that he is risen, that he's no longer dead. So I'm a witness. When he died, I died with him. When he was buried, I was buried with him. When he was raised, I was raised with, raised with him. Yes, sir. I'm sitting, I'm, I'm sitting together with him in heavenly places above principalities and above powers. Somebody shout amen. Amen. By the reason of the resurrection, it means what cannot destroy Jesus cannot destroy me. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. What cannot keep Jesus cannot keep me. Yes, sir. The whole message about resurrection is go, tell, tell them that Jesus is no longer in the grave. And the day of his resurrection, that was the day Christianity was actually better. Yes, sir. Because every other religion, their master or their pioneer, their pioneer or their pathfinder or their forerunner or the ones that introduced such religion, they all died and never came back. If Jesus had died like Buddha, died like Mohammed, there would be no difference between Christianity. Yes. But on the day Jesus resurrected, that was the day Christianity was born. Yes, so therefore this message is titled The Birthday of Christianity. Yes. It's the birthday of Christianity. That was the day that was the day Christianity was better. That was the day our Lord and Savior buried on the third day he rose from the dead conquered principalities, conquered powers. Yes, then he went to hell yes, and he said, hell, show me your power. Yes. And hell says, we have no power to show you anymore. Yes, then he says, you don't have anything anymore. Yes, he sir. came out. He showed the people. Yes. He said, I am resurrected. Jesus, the same yesterday, the same today, the same forever. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. So he actually knew what he was saying when he says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one come to the Father. According to John chapter 14, verse 6, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one come to the Father except by me, except through me, except by me. No one. What is resurrection? The resurrection is the power or energy that quickens the soul. The resurrection is the power or energy that quickens the soul. If the spirit of him, if the spirit of him that raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, if that force, if that spirit dwells in you, he says the same spirit, the same self spirit shall vitalize your mortal body. That means what cannot happen to Jesus cannot happen to you because the spirit that raised Jesus lives in you. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. That's what we are. We are different. We are not the same. We might be in the world with other people. Jesus said we are in the world, but we are not of the world. What makes us different? What makes us different from other people? We have, we have 
uh, we, we are witness. We, we are witnesses of what Jesus. I came back after three days where I was buried. So resurrection power gave birth to Christianity. Resurrection power is what made Christianity not to be a religion. Rest, uh, uh, um, resurrection power is what made Christianity not to be a, an ideology. Resurrection power is what made Christianity different. Yes, sir. Resurrection power, the resurrection of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ made the difference completely when he resurrected because if they had known that he would be risen, they would not kill him. They killed him, they buried him, they put soldiers there, and they put a big stone over the tomb, over the sepulchre of Jesus. And they said, ah, they said, so that later the disciples will not come and pick him, and they will claim that he has resurrected. So when the angels showed up from heaven, the gate men saw Jesus. Yes. They saw their saw. They, they saw the angel with their with their optical eyes. Mm. When they saw the glory that this angel carried, the soldiers were like dead men. Yes. They were not just under the anointing. They saw the glory. Uh -huh. They saw the power yes, of sir. the living God. They saw the glory that came from the angel of His presence, mm. and they were like dead men. Yes, and sir. then the stone was rolled away, and Jesus walked out. And the angel said, "Do not wait for them here." Wait, look for Jesus because the living is not found among the dead. Yes, sir. You don't look for the living in the midst of the dead. He is risen. He will appear to his disciples in Galilee. On, on, the, on the basis of this, I can say, I know Jesus. On the basis of this, I can say, our, the gospel will preach what we believe, what we have seen and what we have believed. It's not just a mere gospel of people talking. It's the gospel of power. It's the gospel of resurrection. Yes, it's the gospel of... Jesus proving that what I said, what God said in my life is done, I've resurrected. And because I've resur re resurrected, because I'm no longer in the grave, every other religion leader, every other one that pioneered any religion, they are still in the grave up to yes, today. Sir. Buddha is still in the grave. Yes, sir. Every other of them is still in the grave. Yes, sir. But Jesus is no more yes, in the grave. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's no more there. It's risen. It's risen. And because Jesus is risen, any grave where they put you, any grave where they put your finances, the resurrection power is breaking through that grave. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Sit down. The resurrection assures and guarantees us communication with Christ. The resurrection assures and guarantees us communication with Christ Jesus. Because he said, on the third day, there will be resurrection. Remember, there's a difference between restoration and resurrection. Yes, sir. So we don't get it missed up. I know some of you will say Lazarus died and on the fourth day he was raised. Who raised him? It's the resurrection that raised him. Ah, the resurrection that raised him. Yeah, I'll prove it to you. John chapter 11, verse 35. You see this? John 11, verse 35. Let's see very quickly. Uh, please, can you help us display this scripture on the screen? So, this was the moment Jesus worked. Let's go on. 36. And then said... And then said the Jews, behold, how he loved him. 37. And some of them said, could not this man which opened the eyes of the blind have caused that even this man should not have died? 38. Jesus therefore again groaning himself, coming to the grave. It was a cave and the stone laid upon it. But then let's go back. Go to verse 30. Go to verse 30. I'll come to this, but this is not where... Uh, I, I'm looking at now. Go to verse 30, please. Thank you. So now Jesus was not yet come. You know, before when they told Jesus, I think that should be around chapter 11, verse 4. And Jesus told them, This sickness is not unto death and all that. Then later I went. Then he told his disciples, Let us go and wake Lazarus. And they were surprised. They said, Why are you going to wake him? If he's asleep, he will wake up by himself. They didn't understand that Jesus was speaking in some. Uh, 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 
in, in, figuratively, he was speaking in some way they would not under, have understanding on their own. And, and now Jesus was not yet come into the town, but was in that place where Martha met him. Now watch this, because oftentimes you say, but Jesus is not the only one that was raised from the dead. That's not correct. Every other person that was raised, that died and was raised, the person was only restored back to life. The only resurrection is Jesus Christ. And there is no restoration without resurrection. Yes, sir. Nobody is raised back to life without the resurrection. Then the Jewish, when the, then, I mean the Jewish, then which were with her in the house and comforted her, when they saw Mary, that she rose up hastily and went out, followed, followed her, saying, she goeth unto the grave to weep there. Verse 32. Then when Mary was come where Jesus was and saw him, she fell down at his feet, saying unto him, Lord, if thou hadst been here, my brother had not died. And when Jesus therefore saw her weeping, and the Jews also weeping, which came with her, he groaned in the spirit and was troubled. Tell the fall. And said, where have ye laid him? They said unto him, Lord, come and see. Then verse 35, he wept. Now, go to verse 36. We're bringing it together now. Then said the Jews, behold, how he loved him. Wow. And some of them said, could not this man, Jesus, which opened the eyes of the blind, have caused that even this man should not have died? Different opinion and reasonings. 38. Jesus, therefore, again, groaning in himself, coming to the grave. It was a cave, and a stone laid upon it. 39. Jesus said, take ye away the stone, matter. The sister of, the sister of him that was dead said unto him, Lord, by this time he stinketh, for he had been dead four days. Four days. That means, even with the embalmment, if they open the place, the smell will be, will be highly offensive. It will stink. And Jesus said unto her, Said that not unto thee, that if thou wouldest believe, thou shouldest see the glory of God. Then they took away the stone from the place where the dead was laid. And Jesus lifted up his eyes and said, Father, I thank thee that thou hast heard me. Uh -huh. And I knew that thou heardest me always. But because of the people which stand by, I said it, that they may believe that thou hast sent me. And when he thus had spoken, he cried with a loud voice, Lazarus, come forth. And he that was dead came forth, bound, hand and foot with grave clothes. And his face was bound about, about with a napkin. Jesus said unto them, lose him and let him go. It takes only resurrection to cause restoration. You didn't hear me. It takes only resurrection to cause restoration. Because Jesus is no longer in the grave, anything that died in your hand, your business, your finances, your marriage, your health, they are coming back to life. Yeah. 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 Your business will come back to life. Amen. Yeah. I say, I'm saying this with all boldness. I don't believe that Jesus was, I mean, Jesus resurrected. I know it. Yes, sir. I, like I know it. You know it. It's not the issue of somebody said, Do you believe? I see it. I know it. He's no longer in the grave. Jesus, the same yesterday, today, and forever. And they said, now this same power have I given unto thee. Go forth. Preach the gospel all over. Be my witness. Go.
tell them. Now, this angel came with just one message. Go and tell. Go and tell. Mm. Imagine the angel left heaven. The angel left heaven. What was the, what was the significance of the angel leaving heaven to come? Just one thing. Go and tell. Go and tell. Go and tell. The angel came with a powerful message. Go and tell them that Jesus is risen. When you live here today, go and tell everyone that Jesus is risen. Is our message every day. Is our message till Jesus comes back again. Is our message till we leave this world. Till Jesus comes back. Go and tell them. What are you going to tell them? Jesus heals. Jesus delivers. Jesus saves. Jesus restores. Jesus gives life. Jesus is the same yesterday, the same today, the same forever. Jesus breaks every yoke. Yes, Jesus heals the sick. Yes. Jesus, every, with, with him, yes, all sir. things are possible. Somebody shout amen. Amen. It takes resurrection to cause restoration. Now, this morning, as you take, as we break the body, the bread, and take the blood of Jesus, anything in you that died will come back to life. Amen. Your business will come back to life. Amen. Your finances will come back to life. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I said they will come back to life. Amen. Faith in resurrection is living in the Savior. Your faith in resurrection is living in the Savior. It's no longer in the grave. Nobody needs to tell me I know it. He broke the power of, he destroyed the power of the grave. Grave, where is your sting? Where is your power? He broke the power of grave. Of, he destroyed the power of grave. He came out. Therefore, what cannot stop him cannot stop me. What cannot stop him cannot stop me. He cannot stop you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I'll show you why. Why he said we must take his flesh and why we must drink his blood. And what happens when we take his flesh and drink his blood? That's one of the ways to get closer to the resurrection power. Even though we have the spirit, the same spirit that raised Jesus from the dead. But if you want to come into daily experience, daily experience of, the, of his resurrection power, You must learn how to take the communion on daily basis. Daily basis. Can I hear amen? amen? Amen. You must learn how to take the communion on daily basis. Once you take the flesh and the blood of Jesus, Jesus lives in you. Yes, sir. The resurrection power lives in you. Dead cannot raise dead. Mm. A dead man cannot raise another dead man back yes, to life. It takes life. You can't give what you don't have. And that's why Jesus introduced himself first to Mary Martha. I think the same John chapter 11, if we read verse 24, let's see verse 24 and verse 25, where he introduced who he is. He introduced himself. He said, this is who I am, even when he's here to resurrect. resurrect. Martha said unto him, I know that he shall rise again in the resurrection at the last day. 25. Jesus said unto her, I am the resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall live again. He introduced himself as resurrection when he's here to die and resurrect. He said, I am, I am the resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. I am. The same I am, I am. I am that I am. I am. And that's why people don't have understanding of I am. Every, everywhere you hear I am, that is God speaking. Yes, sir. And that's why even many Christians will not understand what the word of God says when he says, let the weak say, say I am strong. Let the poor say I am rich. And people will not understand that. People will think, why should I make such confession when I'm actually poor? No, when you make that confession and say I am, 
It means you remove yourself and put God in the equation. Because you are not the I am. God is the I am that I am. Yes. I thought I'm talking to some yes, people sir. this morning. Let the weak say I am strong. Let the poor say I am rich. So every time you declare I am, it's not just you making yourself strong. Let the weak say because you are not strong, but I am is strong. Yes. You are poor, you are not rich, but I am is rich. So every time you say, let the weak say, I am strong. The moment you bring, you say, I am, that means you are removing yourself from the equation. Yes, you are bringing God to the, into the equation. Yes, Who is able to make weak people strong? Yes. You are bringing I am into the equation. Yes, Who owns all the wealth, the gold and the silver, uh -huh. there is. He said, you will lay up gold, you will lay up gold like dust. He said, there is. When you say, you are poor, but you say, I am rich. You are removing yourself. You are bringing I am that I am. Yes, sir. Into the situation. Somebody shout amen. Amen. That's what it means. I am. I am. I am healed. I sent my word and healed their disease. I am healed. I am rich. I am not weak. I am strong. I am that I am. I am. Do you understand that at all? Yes, sir. He didn't, when he came, he introduced himself in the most powerful way. He said, people have always known me as Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Yahweh, Jehovah Nisi, Jehovah Shama. Yes, all, every, they've known me, but there is one thing they've not known me. Wow. And every of the names they know me with is a limited version of me. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. If they introduce me as Jehovah Jireh, I am only limited as God the provider. Yes, sir. If they introduce me as Jehovah Shalom, I am only limited as God, the, 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 I mean the peace giver. If they introduce me as El Shaddai, it means I am the cup or the breast that never run dry. Ah, yes, that is the limited version of God. Yes, and God said, I am going to visit one of their bitterest rivals, enemies in history. He said, when I go there, I don't need to go in the limited version of how people see me. Uh -huh. Because if you, the, the way you limit God is how I will work for you. Yes, sir. Mm. You, cannot, you cannot see you cannot see God beyond your revelation of him. Uh -huh. That's right, sir. If you see him as God who can just give you what to survive, daily bread, to eat, you will be getting food. Mm. Only eat, you're going to eat. But if you see him as Jehovah, Jehovah El Shaddai, the cup that never runs dry, yes, that means I can make demand of billions and billions from him he can give it to me yes, sir. because he is bigger than what you know and that I know. Yes, sir. Can I hear amen? Amen. Now, uh, take home, listen to this. So when he came to Abraham, Abraham, I mean, when he came to Moses, Moses said, but if I go to them, they will ask me who sent me. What will I tell them? God said, wow, this one is serious. And God said, don't tell them Jehovah Jireh. Don't tell them Jehovah Nisi. Don't tell them El Shaddai. Don't tell them Elohim. Tell them that I am that I am have sent you. In other words, when you go to Egypt, you are going to Egypt of, with the revelation of me, my own limited self not my limited self. Yes, you are going into Egypt with my unlimited version. Yes, when you get to Egypt, I am that I am means I will become anything you want me to be. Yes, Papa. I will become anything you want me to be. If you want me to be your healer, I will be your healer. If you want me to be your power, I will be your power. If you want me to be Jehovah, the man of war, yes, I will be the Jehovah, the man of war. Yes, sir. If you want me to be Jehovah, the provider, yes, I am whatever you want me to be. Yes, Baba. Teach. You want me to be a healer, I will be a healer. You want me to be a defender, I will be a defender. Yes. Watch everything it became. Because he didn't go there as a limited version. When they wanted him to be a man of war, he entered into the camp of the Egyptians and slayed and, and slaughtered every firstborn, including that of the beasts. 
Then when they wanted him to be Jehovah, their defender, he said, take the token of the blood and put on your doorpost. I will be Jehovah, the defender, before you, that when the angel of death comes, the angel of death will pass over. Is anybody hearing me? Yes, sir. That means uh, when you get to the Red Sea, you don't know what to do. Yes. I will be Jehovah, the I am that makes way yes, where there is no way. Uh -huh. I will become the one yes. that makes that the one that made way in the Red Sea is somebody hearing me yes, sir. then when, when you get to a certain place uh -huh. when you want me to be light uh -huh. I will become Jehovah light yes, to sir. you and to the camp of your enemy yes. I will be darkness to them yes. but to you I will be light yes. I will be pillar of light to you yes. by day yes. and cloud yes. by night yes. is anybody hearing me yes, sir. and when they go to the wilderness uh -huh. that we are hungry yes sir. that we are so hungry yes sir. and Moses said I want Jehovah yeah. food yes sir ah Jehovah food yeah. Yeah. yes hey. 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 hey hey from this time on Amen. as you take the communion yes sir. in the revelation of I am that I am uh -huh. whatever you want him to be yes. that is what it will be for you Amen. it will be for you protection Amen. it will be for you power Amen. it will be for you deliverance Amen. it will be for you prosperity Amen. it will be for you glory Amen. it will be for you power Amen. it will be for you signs and wonders Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Power. Praise power. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. They say we need food now. Yes, if you are yam that I am, we need the I am food. And the Bible said in the morning they saw manna everywhere. Because they have never seen that type of food before. Yes, sir. How do you love to eat food you, you have never seen before? You don't know how it tastes. Yet you love the food. You know what manna means? Manna simply means, what is this? After eating manna, not too long, they became thirsty. They said, we need water. And they said, if you want water, I am water. Jehovah overflow. <laughs> Hey! Hey! From today, I want you to know the revelation of this God. He is not a limited God. He is not a limited God. That's why one time the people of Israel went to war. They said the reason why they won was because they fought in the mountains. And God said, tell them, the same God of the mountain and the same God in the valley. The same God in the mountain and the same God in the valley. Everything I created, I created for my pleasure. In other words, he was creating for fun. Whatever he created, he created for his pleasure. And he said, Moses, speak to the water. It will become rock. I mean, speak to the rock, it will become water. And he spoke to the rock. And water gushed out. The people quenched their thirst. What a God. Now imagine if he had introduced himself as Jehovah. Shama. One edition and limited part of God is what they will say. He said, no. I want you to see everything, everything. I am everything you want me to be. So what is your revelation of God, of who God is? What is your revelation of Jesus? That's exactly what God did when he appeared, when the, when the spirit of the Lord came upon Jesus in Luke chapter 9 verse 35. Everything was commanded to listen to the version of God that he is. I am that I am. Luke 9 35 Luke chapter 9 verse 35 and there came a voice out of the cloud saying this is my beloved son hear him hear him so you come to a dimension now it didn't say living things hear him it didn't say no living things animate and inanimate objects yes sir nothing give, give me give me this in give me this in amplified 
Then after Amplified, give me New Living Translation. Then we'll, we'll, we'll pray. Then we'll take the communion. Everything. Then a voice came out of the cloud saying, this is my beloved son, my chosen one. Listen, 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 listen. That means when you come to the revelation of who God is, his yes. almightiness, you come to the revelation of the I am that I am. You come to the, to the knowledge and revelation of resurrection. It is whatever you want him to be that it will be. There are yes. people that are too afraid to ask God for big things. Big things. If you are a covenant person, you understand the revelation of who God is. Stop asking him for small things. Lack of revelation. Ask for big, big things. Big things. Because he owns everything. He is bigger than any big thing. He is bigger than the biggest things. You can't, you can't, you can't get from God what you don't know that exists in Him. Yes, sir. Mm. This is my beloved son, my chosen one. Listen, obey, and yield to Him. Everything yield to Him. Everything, Everything must listen. So, except I have not spoken to that thing. Except I have not spoken to that thing. And look at that. Let's let let let's see how this I am at, at that. The I am that I am resonated in the ministry of Jesus. That's why some of the resumes of the I am that I am in the ministry of Jesus. After this encounter, he spoke to the water. And the water responded to him. The water became wine. He spoke to the wind, a boisterous wind, and said, Calm down. The wind obeyed his voice. He spoke to the fish. Five loaves of bread and two fish. He said, I want you to increase fish, bread. You know, look at what he said. He didn't say, Father, provide. He said, thank you, Father. He gave thanks to the I am that I am that can become anything you want him to become. Yes, sir. So, thank you, I am that I am. Yes, surplus, surplus, surplus. Surplus, surplus, surplus. Multiplication. They ate so much that they went home. With some, and yet they have 12 baskets left over. 12 baskets. That's what it became. I want you to watch it. And another time, he said, water. I am that I am. So water, I want you to be, for me, a wall. I want to walk on you. And he began to walk on top of water. Everything, listen to him. Obey him. Hear him. So when... What, when the disciples saw him, they said, ah, he's a ghost. He's a ghost. You know, when you begin to know what people don't know in God, they can call you names. And understand this always. The same people that tell you more grace. See, they say, you see the grace increases in you, they begin to fight you. <laughs> can I hear him, somebody? They begin to criticize the grace. They try to say things to rubbish the grace. But they cannot. Because they don't know what you know. They don't know your source. They don't know your revelation. The more they criticize you, the more you increase in size. They criticize, we increase in size. <laughs> hey! They criticize, we increase in size. <laughs> they criticize we increase in size if your criticism is making me to increase please continue with it if your criticism is increasing my anointing increasing my power is making me go to God more and more as never before please continue Exploding on every side. On every side. Ah. Grace is better. And they saw him. They say it's a ghost. He said, no, no. Because they have never seen that dimension. Once you enter dimension, you have left some dimensions. Mm. You have left the people that were in the same lane with you. Yes, sir. They are the same people that will criticize you. Yes, sir. And say, no, don't mind what he's doing. They are the same people. Mm. 
The same people. The mm. same people. Because of the dimension. Dimension. Separates you from people. <laughs> and look at this. Peter said, okay, if you are truly Jesus, the one we know, bid me to come. And Peter, Jesus said, come now. I'm here, you can come. So Peter began to walk on top of the water. And very soon, he began to limit God. He said, ah, how can somebody walk on top of water? No walk. The moment he limited God, that was the end of God walking for him there. He began to sink. Your limitation of God, God will not go beyond your revelation of him. Yes, sir. It's not possible. You cannot travel, you can only travel to the countries you have their visa. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You can't travel to countries you don't have their visa. <laughs> Amen, somebody. You can't. But there is there are passports you hold. It can take you to several countries. It's unlimited knowledge. Yes, sir. Uh, great is like that. So the same way some people are limited, they can't go beyond. Mm. Some other people have passports, they just wake up and buy tickets. They can go to over 100, 150 countries. Yes, sir. Without visa. Without visa. Dimension, sir. What is your knowledge visa in who God is? Hey! Makade Yaba. I want to grow. Immediately, Peter began to sink. And Jesus did not dare to help him. Hmm. Yeah, because you must understand the rules of engagement. Rules of engagement. Until he shouted, Master, help, help me. Master, then help Jesus stretched for his hand mm. to mm. help him. So God cannot come into what is not invited to come yes, into. Yes, sir. Until you understand that every day I must go to God. Every now and then I must have covenant. I must be consistent in the place of prayer. Any season your prayer life is weak, that season is a season of attack, of great manifestation that the enemy wanted, want, wanted uh, the manifestation to waste away. Mm. Don't ever settle. If you lose anything, no problem, but you must never lose your prayer life. If you lose money, it's okay. Yes. It's not attack. It's not attack. But when you when you lose your prayer life, ah. that is the re attack. Re -attack. Because the accurate measure of your spiritual life is your yes, prayer sir. life. Your prayer life, yes, sir. You can't say I'm spiritual mm. and your prayer life is off. Ashes on your prayer altar. Child. Ashes on your prayer closet. No. The accurate measure of your spiritual life, when you say, I'm a spiritual person, the, me the accurate measure of it is your prayer life. prayer life. If you are five minutes man of prayer, that's how your spiritual life is. Mm. That's why the Bible talks about the measures of it. Some people have food. Full. Full he said Jesus was full. Mm. With what? With the Holy Ghost. The Not everyone is full. It's something you must increase consistently, whether you like it or not. Or not. So Jesus, again, there was the dimension. I want money. Go to the river, fish, catch fish, vomit money. So he saw that God can respond to anything you know him of. From today, I am that I am, we respond to you. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. He will respond to you. Amen. John chapter 16 verse 13. We're done. We're done. We're going to pray. As soon as, this com as soon as you take this communion, that marks the end of any affliction you came with today. Amen. When the spirit of truth comes, he will guide you into all truth. He will not speak on his own, but will tell you what he has heard. He will tell you about the future. That's the reason why a spiritless Christian is a powerless Christian. Yes, is a blind Christian. The Spirit is our, the Holy Ghost is our director, is our teacher. And Jesus said, I introduce the Spirit to you. He will teach you all things. Lift up your hands. From today, may the Spirit teach you the fullness and the almightiness of God. 
the dimensions of God that you have never seen before. Amen. That your eyes be open to Amen. see dimensions of God that existed that you never knew. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. There are places and countries that exist that you've never, you might never hear their name till you die. Are you aware? But they are there. Lift up your hands. I want you to speak in the Holy Ghost. Open your mouth. I'm not saying you should talk to yourself or you should sell only wise. Open your mouth. Speak in the Holy Ghost. Lekedo Shakata, Nantu Kapa de Zeke Palata, Eprekota Nakapas, Likato Sakata, Mante Kapas, Mante Kapas, Mante Kapas, Ete Katasha, Ete Katasha, Ete Katasha, Manta Kapas, Manta Kapas, Manta Kapas, Lekete Pas, Lekete Pas, Mante Katusa, Mante Katusa, Lekedus Kapas, Lekatamaha, Lekete Mahande, Elesia, Nasadapa, Reketeta, Ligatanta, Ligate Kasa, Ele Kapon de Brekete, Ike Palakata, Ike Pem de Katapaha, Ike de Kapreketena, Ete Katapreketenata, Esakata, Esakata, Ete Kapasa, Ete Kapasa, Ete Kapasa, Malekadesha, Malekadesha, Ike de Takapasa, Ike de Takapasa, Ike de Kadesha, Ike de Katapaha. He commandos kabazato bakra sakato leka bakata yado basande mankalato shepa kato sawa na pariando palika sota yande bakandara te kopakaya lekro sapande jacopa yanda labarate kopa pakotaya pakrusia valarante. Shakola Baradia, Male Pato, Shaba, La Kapa, Rande de Besha, Rapato Zawadia, Mengra Safate, Embaskapato, Jabirande, Enondua Sandela, Ekonka Patayata, Rabatate, Roka, Elaguasata, Nambasha, Lagasato, Badia, Wakatasha, Rabados, Eragadaya, Maraba. Jabalagada, Androfasia, Barote, 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 Gasuata, 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 Ledos Kama, Baronde, Corusatia, Pafruscatia, Quatasia, Ekomba, Ekomba, Kotoya, Labuka, Barubadia, Wasia Namando, Baricosata, Kawadia, Keleparado, Jacataia, Lokodo and Kompanke Konde Jadu Baladua Barake Barake Korosutu Jabarataia Mambra Zede 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 Kulawata Kulawata Kugulege Gugulepe Rabudia Barosate Cambrosa Imbobos Imbodia Balogawa in Jesus mighty name we pray if the grave could not hold Jesus any grave where they have buried you buried your destiny buried your health buried your glory let that grave open up and vomit it Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any grave. Any grave. Demonic grave. Demonic grave. Where they bury my glory. Where they bury my glory. Where they bury my finances. Where they bury my finances. My marriage. My marriage. My greatness. My greatness. 
my greatness, my greatness, my children, my children, my unborn children, my unborn children, my wealth, my wealth, my riches, my riches, my destiny, my destiny, wherever, wherever, what, wherever grave, wherever grave, we are the buried, we are the buried by the resurrection power, by the resurrection power, are you grave, who are you grave, open up, open up, hear the word of the Lord, hear the word of the Lord, open up, open up, for me, for me, for me, my inheritance, my inheritance. My belongings, my belongings, vomit it, vomit it. Fire. fire, clap your hands and pray. morning now any obstacle that the road they put before your way that is blocking you it shall be rolled away this morning Amen. any obstacle any obstacle before you 
that have blocked you, barricaded you, resist that have resisted your next level, yes. resisted your helpers, yes. resisted your glory, yes. resisted you yes. from coming into where you are supposed yes. to be. As we pray, yes, that stone will be rolled off. Yes. Say by fire, by fire. Say every stone, every stone, every obstacle, every obstacle blocking me, blocking me, blocking my resurrection, blocking my, resurrection. Blocking my next level. Blocking my next what level. are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? By the fire of the Holy Ghost, the fire of the Holy Ghost. we roll you off. We roll you off. We clear 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 you off. By fire, by fire. I have prayed. Clear it off. Somebody pray. Every stone that covers your life, every stone that covers the grave, every cover. Father, let the stone be rolled away, be rolled away, be rolled away, be rolled away. That angel that rolled away, the stone roll away, every stone. Now everyone, take up a sacrifice in your hand. There's a prayer we're going to pray. Don't take an offering, take up a sacrifice. The force that raised Lazarus, that brought Lazarus out of the grave, anything that belongs to you, that you have been praying for, that you have been fighting for, but they buried it in the grave, in the sepulchre, in the tomb, that thing will answer you now. Hey, hey. Take it up. Take it up. Lift it up. Don't take an offering. Take a sacrifice. Take something that is painful to you. Lift it up. Let me have mine. Quickly. Oh. Let me have mine. Take it up. Quickly. Lift it up. Say, Father. Father. Say, Father. Father. Say, Father. Father. I lift up this sacrifice. I tie it to the blood of Jesus. To the blood of Jesus. And to the power of his resurrection. And to the power of his resurrection. I engage the power of the altar. I engage the power of the altar. Therefore, I declare. Therefore, I declare. Any grave. Any grave. Where they bury me. Where they bury me. Any grave. Any grave. Where they put my Lazarus. Where they put my Lazarus. As I pray. As I pray. And I get this altar. I get this I break out. I break out. My Lazarus. My Lazarus. Come forth. Come forth. Now. 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 By, fire. By fire. Open your mouth. Pray. pray. My Lazarus. Take your stop dropping. Come forth. Come on. 
or your health been buried now by the resurrection power they will respond to you hey. I said that will respond to you hey. Amen. the grave will open up now Amen. the grave will the grave will vomit your glory Amen. vomit your marriage Amen. vomit your health Amen. vomit your finances Amen. for me Lift up your hands. Close your eyes. I want ushers to help me. Just my prayer will not be more than five minutes. Then we'll take the communion, then share the grace. Lift up your hands, everybody. But if you are here, you have been battling with anything that had to do with your health, that disturbs your health. And it's not something they can help you with medically. Place your right hand on your chest or any area you experience that in. Place it. I'm saying chest. Somebody is putting their, his hand on his head. But if there is any place where you physically experience that in, you can put your right hand there. I pass from your chest. Yes. I pass from your chest. Any other, any place you know you physically experience that, you can put your hand. But especially when this has to do with a situation that have defined medical and natural solution. Maybe you go to a hospital, they say they don't know what is wrong with you, but you are suffering. Or hospital tells you they cannot help you. Put your hand over there. Three things will happen. Number one, people that are banned, banned in the grave not to prosper, not to succeed, not to get married, they will come out of the grave. Number two, the finances, wealth, and destinies of people will be vomited. The power of grave. When I say the power of grave, it had to do with the strong man, the strong woman, the altar. Yes, means whatever that is holding you or blocking you. Yes, sir. Their power will be destroyed. Amen. And thirdly, there will be instant healings. Instant, instant, instant. Close your eyes. Lift up your hands. If you have your right hand on your chest, those of you, then lift up the other hand. Close your eyes. Please, 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 no noise, no disturbance. I release the spirit of miracles. Amen. I release the spirit of creative miracles. Amen. I release the spirit of creative miracles. Amen. Kadua Mahayanam Badi Asata. I release the anointing of strange healings. Amen. I release the spirit of working of miracles. Yeah.
I release the spirit that heals in the blood. Yes. Amen. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. By the prophetic mantle. Yes. And the apostolic mantle. Yes. Of fire on my head. Yes. And by the privilege of divine election. Uh -huh. I hereby decree and I declare yes. that every power that kept you in the grave, yes. any grave where they put you, yes. where they put your glory, yes. that they have abandoned and kept you, yes. not to let you go. Yes. By the power of the Holy Ghost, yes. I command the release now. Amen. 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 I break the power of grace. Yes. I break the chains of grave. Amen. I break the chains of grave here. Amen. Every stone blocking them yes. from coming out from the grave. Yes. I roll it away. Amen. I clear it away. Amen. I clear it away. Amen. I clear it away. Amen. I I clear it away. Amen. I clear it away. Amen. Now I break the yoke yes. of the grave. Yes. I break the napkins of the grave. Yes. I command the grave to open up. Yes. Open up. Yes. For me. 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 Yes. That man. Yes. That woman. Yes. That boy. Yes. Now yes. I command you. Yes. All your grave. Yes. For me. That man. Yes. For me. That woman. Yes. For me. That boy. Yes. For me. That girl. Yes. Now. Yes. Now. Yes. Now. For me, come out. Yes. Let him go. Yes. Let him go. Yes. Let him go. Yes. Let her go. Yes. Let that man. Yes. That woman. Yes. For me. 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 Yes. I move the hand of God. Yes. I move the hand of God. Yes. I move the hand of God. Yes. Into the grave. Yes. Carry them from the grave. Yes. Carry them from the grave. Yes. Let the grave be open. Yes. Open now. Yes. I release that man. Yes. That woman. Yes. That boy. Yes. That girl. Yes. That man, yes. let no remain in the grave. Yes. By the power of the Holy Ghost, yes. come out! Yes. Yes. Come out! Break out! Yes. Break out! Yes. Break out! Yes. You will not stay in the grave anymore. Yes, sir. You will not stay in the grave anymore. Yes, sir. Your glory will not stay in the grave anymore. Yes, sir. Your marriages will not stay in the grave anymore. Yes. Your wombs will not stay in the grave anymore. Yes, sir. Yes. Nadu farata, yes. parande kurata, yes. baraka ko, yes. kaku mande yes. paya, yes. rato shut up. Yes. Now let the grave open, yes. open, open, yes. open, open. Yes. From it, from it, yes. from it. Yes. That man, from it, yes. that man. I command you. Yes. Now. Yes. Yes. Now. Yes. Now. Yes. Now. Yes. By the mandate of heaven. Yes. That chain. Yes. That power. Yes. Sir. That strong man. Yes. That strong woman. Yes. Struggling with them. Yes. Not to come out of the grave. Yes. I clear you. 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 Yes. I break your power. Yes. I break your resistance. Yes. Let that man go. Yes. Let that man go. Yes. Let that man go. Yes. Let that boy. Go. go! Let that boy go. go! Let that boy go! go. Let that woman go. go! Let that woman go. go! Let that woman go. go! Let that girl 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 go. go! Let that child go. go! From it! Yes! From it! From it! From it! From it! From it! Oh yeah! Yes! 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 Now! Yes! Now! Yes! Now! Yes! Now, yes, now, yes, now, yes, now, yes, 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 but the power of the Holy Ghost come at a fire, come at a fire, come at a fire, come at a fire, but the power, but the fire of the Holy Ghost, but the power will break your resistance, but the power of the Holy Ghost come at a fire, come at a fire, come at a fire, come at a fire, let them go, let them go, let them. Go, Holy Ghost, will he stay? Will he start woman? Will he start poor? Will he start there? From the power, from the custody of darkness, by your power. Now, 
Nama mo sevre angrados. Barigo sevra andia. Lekoros akripata. Those eight people that carry the glory of their family. Yes. But they are still being heard in the grave. Yes. Oh Lord, they need help. If yes. there is any time they ever needed your help, is yes. now. All the eight of them yes. that are still heard by in the grave, yes. we release them now yes. by the power of the Holy yes. Ghost. Break, break, yes. break, yes. break, yes. break, yes. break, yes. break. Yes. wherever you put your hand don't mind lift it up everybody lift up your both hands lift up your both hands lift up your both hands sabada hokus in baduan sambiende en cumbre en alavrosia candos kimbro odoski ebelia loguan gre kebro zevra nabiado zababaha gado kadia malaguande en grusabiato rebedia rebedia en longra basando o cabada grosevre en alapata ketoka padia paticato 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 kendia bande bala honda paracata ya lokapa corabe ya kete 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 barucawadia melembo roco ira Irako, yes, K, 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 Bako, 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 Yaya, Barakata, Baraka. Those five persons you showed me, their garment of greatness is still lying on the grave. Yes, all their glory, yes, all their glory, yes, all their glory. Yes, five of them will release their garment from that grave, yes, from that grave, yes, from that grave, yes, their garment, yes, of glory, yes, of riches, yes, of marriage, yes, of health, yes, of wealth, yes, of financial transfer, destinies, yes, five of them yes come upon yes yes come. yes there are five of them have them yes 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 when they close when they stand they are glory they are star when they stand now when they stand now by your power by your fire by your power by your fire the joseph of your life the chosen of your family when they close when they close when they stand when they stand now by your power, by your fire, by your power, by your fire, by your power, by your fire, let them go, 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 holy ghost, let them be released, let them be released, let them be released, by your power, by your fire, by your power, by your fire, by your power, by your fire, release that Joseph, release that David, release that Esther of your family. By your power, by your fire, by your power, by your fire, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, break the prison gate open, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, break the prison gate, let the prison gate break open, by your power, by your fire, let the be release, let the be release, let the be release, let the be release, let the be released, let the be released, let the ball and silence, let the be released, let the be released from that place of their father's side, from their mother's side, let that Peter be released from that place of their father's side, only goes carry them out by your papa. Lift up your hands. That sickness, that affliction, yes, 
they have, that they have diseased your body with. Lekohombros. Vida lukumbarita. Manianko wande. Shabi ankros. Elehanka. Mano ande sifra. Noku paradia. Enolia maswate. Kadifaha. Fado kamande. Katuwala. Lakwa akate. Perado. Piraga. Lagrobade. Ikwate mana niano. Nakumbalia. Barate. Kuraba. Waka pode. Parakato. Kakwa pa. Yes. yes. Now, yes. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, sir. By the God that I serve, my yes. God. And your God. Yes, sir. Let every strange affliction, uh -huh. object, yes, growth, moving growth in your body. Yes. Melakwade. Kabandia. Nabadia. Kabandia, Nabadia, Elo Mahan one day, Namondia, Halagra, Sivre, Emia, Emia, Lehoma Niama, Yes, Mono Quandede, Badiato, Yes, Tukuma Diama one day, Yes, Wali Kaba, Roke, Roke, Yes, Kaburavia, Yes, Rapa, Reco, now affliction, Yes, over that man, Yes, over that woman, Yes. Over that body, yes, you demon of affliction, yes, your power of affliction, yes, in that blood, yes, that have defied medical, yes, and natural solution, yes, that have defied prayers, yes, hear the word of the Lord, yes, by the power of the Holy Ghost, yes, be uprooted from that body, yes, be uprooted from that body, yes, come out of that blood, come out, come out of that bone, come out, come out of their body, come out, anyone here, yes, anyone watching me, yes. What their television, yes. or their Facebook, yes. or their YouTube. Yes. I command that affliction. Yes. I command that sickness yes. in your blood. Yes. The demon of affliction. Yes. The power responsible. Yes. I go to the root. Yes. I go to their root. Yes. I go to their source. Yes. I uproot them. Yes. I uproot them. Yes. I uproot them. 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 By the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. Sir. By the power. Of the Holy Ghost, yes, be uprooted, yes, be uprooted, yes, be uprooted, yes. I see about 18 of them, yes, sir. under strange affliction, yes, sir. But as I speak now, yes, sir. the power of God will begin to attend to them, yes, sir. and it will mark the end of that affliction, yes, sir. Father, all the 18 of them, yes, sir. Unto you, God, the answer and prayer, yes, sir. Shall all flesh come, yes, sir. All this flesh they have come, yes, looking for your help, yes, help them, oh Lord, yes, sir. Help them, oh Lord, yes, help them, oh Lord, yes. Let the affliction yes, be terminated yes, from over 18 of them. Yes. Now, yes. move in your element. Yes. Move in your element. Yes, Lord. Move in your dimension. Yes, Lord. I allow the sickness and the diseases. Yes, Lord. The affliction, the spirit behind yes. it. From the root, from yes. the foundation. Yes. I begin to go. Yes. Holy Ghost. Yes. The angels working with me. Yes. And the element of Elohim. Yes. Carry all of them now. Yes. I yes, now. Yes, Lord. Have them, have them, have yes, them. Lord. Have them. Yes, Lord. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, by your power, this pastor enters the enters of healing, enters of miracle at work in this commission by your power, by your fire, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, by your fire, by your power, this past the enters of miracles, of strange miracles, of strange heart, of strange healing in this congregation by your mighty power. Let the sickness die, let it dry up, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, carry them out, carry them out. By your power, Holy Spirit, touch them now, touch them now, touch them now, with your power, with your mighty power, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, touch them with your power, with your power, with your power. In the name of Jesus, Amen. lift up your hands, close your eyes. Even if we sing, don't sing. Just close your eyes. Remaining 17 of them will be rescued. Spirit of the Sovereign Lord, come and make your, your presence glory be the glory of, of the living God. Spirit of the Sovereign Lord, come and make your presence glory be 
about there are many 17 people they will see the glory the glory the weight of the glory of God is going to help them the spirit of the sovereign Lord the wisdom of God is here can you lift up your hands father there are 17 of them remaining with strange afflictions let today 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 Good Friday is their gift let it mark the end of that affliction completely now lift up your hands close your eyes yes Lord Angels on assignment, carry them, carry them, all the 18 of them, carry them, carry them, carry them, carry them, as you remove the affliction, carry them, yes, yes, that is it, 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 Basic voice, trust and lift up your hands. You are the one that is being helped.
the healing angels, the deliverance angels that came with me, walking with me, carry them, carry them, carry them, carry them, carry them. Yes, yes help them. Let none of them remain. Let none of them remain yes. in that position of affliction. Yes. Take them out of the position yes. of affliction and destroy the position. Yes. Destroy the power of the affliction. Yes. Carry them. Carry them. Yes. Wherever they are, including those watching via television, yes. via Facebook, via YouTube, everywhere. The power of God. Yes. Out of God. Yes. Out of God. I up your hands please everywhere be silent just for the next 60 seconds close your eyes if you are watching via television or Facebook YouTube place your right hand on the screen now angels walking with me thank you Lord for your mighty angels that do your bid that excel in strength now assist them and bring them now just be calm yeah. 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 Lift your hands if you're asked to do so, do it in the next few seconds. Thank you, Lord, for your mighty angels. Thank you. Uh, yes, help, help every one of them. Help every one of them. Help every one of them, especially those under that strange affliction that cannot be helped medically. Yeah, that is it. That is it. That is it. That is it. Thank you. Yes, carry them. What of, what of the man? What of that girl? Uh huh. That is it. Thank you. What of the boy? What of that boy? Yes. What of that woman? Help them. Thank you. Help them. Yes. Holy Spirit, identify them. Identify them. You reveal to redeem. 
identify them. Help them, help them, help them, help them, help them. Help them, help them, help them. Identify them, help them, help them, help them. Help them, help them. Yes, Holy Spirit. I know many of them have been there for a long time. Now, to the root, to the root, to the root, to the root, to the root. Cut it off from the root. Help them, yes. Help them, 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 help them. Do not let any of them go back the same way. In your great, in your mighty power, in the greatness of your power. How many there? A friend that I can trust. That is why you remember my great physician. Everywhere I go, lift up your hand. Can you just do that? Thank you. We do Lord. Lord, the remaining four of them help them will break the power of affliction resisting their healing. Break the name of Jesus Heaven. by the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. By the mandate, the apostolic fire yes. and the mantle of the prophetic fire yes. on my head. Yes. I break your resistance over yes. them. Let that woman go. Yes. Let that boy go. Yes. Let that man go. Yes. Let that girl go. Yes. Release all the four of them yes. right now. Yes. Thou power of God. Yes. Move. Yes. All of them stand up. We don't have time. Position them. Let me pray for them. Oh, everybody, everybody. Where I can be. A place where I have a secret. Quickly. To one. A place where I am. Be saved after all. All, all, all. all of you standing here. If you have been sick and maybe you have, go, you are going, you have gone to the hospital. Hold on. You've gone to the hospital yet nothing happens. Lift up your hand. Let me see. Let me see. You have been sick. You have been sick. You have been sick within you, but people don't even know you are sick. But when you go to the hospital, they can't even see anything. Lift up your right hand. Let me see. Just lift. Let, let it remain lifted. Thank you, Jesus. The affliction is over. Jesus. So of you to lift your hand, you are carrying picture. The pack full album. Jesus. Be healed. You are healed. Be healed. Jesus. Moving in Be healed. Affliction is over. You come back to testify. I worship. Affliction is over. Jesus. Affliction is over. I worship. Is over. You are healed. You are healing everyone. Let them go. I Jesus. Jesus. 
Let them go. In the name of Jesus. You are Be free. You are touching everyone. I worship you. I worship you. You are here. to kill her, I kill you. You want her dead? Huh? You said what? You're supposed to die why coming. You made her to enter bike. Who are you? Huh? Who are you? Altar from my father's house. And I stand by the mobile altar of God in my life. Yes. I crush you, the altar of the Father's house. Your covenant right and access, I cancel, I override, I overturn it, I revoke it. Park and go. Trouble her no more. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for our deliverance. Be free. Jesus. Power. Bring, her. bring her. Bring her, bring her, bring her. Don't waste my time. No. Look at me. Pack your load and go. You wicked spirits. And come back no more. Quickly. Pack and go. You gave me strength. Trouble her no more. Bring it. Bring her. Strength to roar. Look at me. Hey! Out! Come back no more. Bring her. You made it way. You cannot leave her. Huh? No. You cannot leave her. You want to kill her. Who are you? Who are you? Huh? Altar. Now I deploy this altar. Altar versus altar. I crush this altar. Amen. Let her go. In Jesus' mighty name. We settle the matter. No. Thank you, Jesus. It cannot go anywhere. No. No. It's going nowhere. It's going nowhere. It's going nowhere. Says who? It's going nowhere. Says who? I'm a masquerade. You'll be masquerade. You'll be masquerade. I resemble masquerade for you. A protocol, can you? Uh -huh. Closer. It's going oh. nowhere. It's going nowhere. Yes. You are the masquerade. Huh? Yes. Of the father's house. Yes. Who brought I'm you? working with 200 witches. Two witches. 200 witches. 200 witches. Yes. Uh, come on, witches. Witches are not powerful now. Huh? We took police in the office. You took what? Took police in the office. In the office? Yes. Uh, so masquerade, two colleagues, 200 witches. 
That's 230. How many remain? Again, you're down away, man. I don't kill him, I don't kill him. Shut up your mouth. All the witches, I go to their coven. I cut off their heads. Yeah. And those one in the office fighting, I sack them from the office. Amen. Yeah. Masquerade. I know the great, the great grandfather brought you. They were serving you and they were in charge of the masquerade in the village. Now, by the blood of Jesus, I release this young man. It's no longer for you. I break that offer and the dedication of his life. So you small masquerade, get out and never come back again. Thank you, Jesus, for his deliverance. Power! Jesus. Stand to your feet. You'll be 200 witches. You'll be masquerade. You'll be two colleagues. It doesn't matter who you are. It's the power. It's the strength. It's the government. Nigeria can be 200 million people, but one man that is the president can say, they declare today public holiday. Why they not go work? <laughs> You can say Tuesday is public holiday. Yes, it's a government. It's a government. We are government here. Mountaka. On behalf of the government of heaven. Lift up your hands. I declare from today. Amen. All the witches fighting you. As you leave this place, I clear them out of your way. Amen. Bring him. Bring him. Come, come, come. How are you? How are you? You are fine? Huh? Look at me, look at me. You are fine. Yes. But you were not fine before. Now, just a few minutes ago, now you come fine. You only became fine a while ago. You know this masquerade from your father's house? Yes, sir. My you, father used to worship it. The father used to worship it. They would call him every January. They, they would call the masquerade every January. Every January. And I'm living with my father. You are living with him? Father. You are living with your father? Yes. And at the masquerade, they invade your life. <laughs> Plus 200 witches and two colleagues in the office. Look at me. Look at me. Look, just look into my eyes. Look, look, look. Look into my eyes. You are going to get back what they have taken from you. Just look at my eyes. Power! So, lift up your hands. You will never know lack. The word of the Lord just dropped to my right ear. He said this. He said, because you came this morning, that whatever power that stopped you, that kept you from advancing, that power is cleared away. Amen. There shall be resurrection in your finances. Amen. In your business, in your health, Amen. in your family. In the name of Jesus. Yeah. I want you to take a resurrection, restoration seed in your hand, everybody. Battle seed. Take it up quickly. Lift it up. I prophesy and I declare by this instruction, as you walk out of this place, there shall be evidential testimonies. Amen. Jesus, my the name. Take it, come forward, drop it. You say, I don't have cash. You are led. You want to make transfer. You can do that. Those of you watching, as they drop, I pray for viewers all over the world. Every one of you, all the viewers around the world, wherever you are watching from, I declare by the resurrection power in the name of Jesus, I declare that your case is settled right now. I declare that whatever that will not let you go, that thing will go for your sake. In the name of Jesus Christ, I declare you free. I release you from affliction. I release you from the powers of the grave. I release you from the demonic personality, from the witches of your father's house and of your mother's house, from the powers fighting you anywhere. In the name of Jesus, I break you free from their hands. I declare you set free. I command that sickness in your body, in your blood, terminated! In the name of Jesus. Now hear the word of the Lord. Touch my hand now. As you touch my hand on the screen, 
any, any spirit behind your matter, they will manifest and go now. Watch this. Yes, you demon, you family spirit, you spirit husband, you spirit wife, you witchcraft spirit, that will not let that man go, that woman, that boy, that girl, that child. Now, hear the word of the Lord. Come out! Enter no more. Be delivered, be healed. I command restoration on every side. Is settled. Begin to send message. Let us know what is going on. Miracles, deliverance are happening right now. Restoration. Stand to your feet. Stand to your feet. I want you to take the communion. Lift it up. John chapter 6. Give me verse number 53. John chapter 6. Uh, Minister Gabriel, sing. Uh, sing uh, I want you to take this uh, prophetic song about the blood of Jesus. not easy to be Pastor Sylvester. Today that is not around, they are just malfunctioning anyhow. Please, do and come back. It's not easy to be a pastor. Once I look, he knows what I'm looking. If I just they torment me anyhow. Go this way, do this one, do this thing. How do we go? Please <laughs> take it off. Lift up your communion. Thank you. Then Jesus said unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, Except ye eat the flesh of the Son of Man and drink his blood, ye have no life in you. Whoso eateth my flesh and drinketh my blood hath eternal life. And I will raise him up at the last day. For my flesh is meat indeed, and my blood is drink indeed. He that eateth my flesh and drinketh my blood dwelleth in me, and I in him. So this is how the resurrection power, you know, lives in you. This is how the re uh, resurrection power comes into you. He that, as the living Father has sent me, and I live by the Father, so he that eateth me, even he shall live by me. As you eat the flesh of Jesus and drink his blood, the life of Jesus, the life of resurrection, will be evidential in your life. 
And if there be any sickness or any forces of darkness around you, militating against you or your life, that thing will die in the name of Jesus. That sickness will be terminated. What cannot kill Je what cannot stop Jesus cannot stop you. Amen. What cannot kill Jesus cannot kill you. Amen. Well, bless it in the name of God the Father Amen. and of the Son Amen. and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Viewers all over the world, I know some of you don't have communion. You can take that non-alcoholic wine from your fridge, grab it. You can take that uh, beverage that is non-alcoholic, grab it. Take that bread, take that biscuit, lift it up since you don't have any you are watching us. Take it, lift it up. Now, as they are lifted, I bless it now. I release the resurrection power of Jesus into the flesh and that blood. As you drink it, as you eat and drink it, may it become power of deliverance, power of healing, power of breakthrough, restoration for you in the name of God the Father, Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Now, join me. Let's take it. Name of God the Father, Son, the Holy Spirit. Lift up your hands. Pastor Peter, I can see you are trying to cover up for Pastor Sylvester. You are trying, but Pastor Victor don't know Pastor Sylvester, so he can't cover up for him. Shout amen. amen. Lift up your hands. To be Pastor Sylvester, you know how many years it took me to raise him? You will need at least 18 years. Yeah. 18 years. He's been with me from day one. When I say from day one, the week God commissioned this ministry, this church, from day one, the first week. So it will take... It will take at least 18 years and that's why when people come around, they just want to, they don't know how the guy understood me. I followed me. He's the epitome of loyalty. Some people saw him driving car. They saw him own a house. And they want to own the same house without going through what the man went through. He has never given me headache for one day. One day. When I say one day, one day. For one day. Not even for once. For one day. Even when it looks like we don't have future. Because you are looking at today, you didn't see yesterday. <laughs> you are looking at today. There were days when we finished ministration, we don't have what to eat. We're climbing Okada. There were days like that. There were days when after service, there's no car to go to church. We have to screw and hide and enter church and all that. No package. <laughs> Amen? Amen? The Bible says, man, who through patience and promise... I mean, through faith and patience, entered into the promise. You must serve through faith and patience. If not, you are in a hurry because you are greedy. If I say, Peter, go and kill somebody, he will say, when do you want me to kill the person? <laughs> Is it now, tomorrow? <laughs> Amen. Whatever you are not committed to, forget it. No matter how many years you play around there, if you play around, it will expose you. Yes. Lift up your hands.
As you go, go and succeed. Yeah. And as you celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ, nothing will bring you down. Yeah. Anything they set up on your way before now, I clear that in a way. Yeah. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Anything waiting for you at any junction. I release the missiles of prayer. I release the arrow of prayer. To clear that in a way before you get to that junction. It might be at the junction of your destiny. It might be at the junction of your breakthrough. It might be at the junction of your major decision in life. I clear it away. Anything that wants to kill you, they will die your death. Is it possible for somebody to be protected against death? Yes. Everybody will die, but you can be protected not dying before your time. Number one, he says the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run it into it, they are safe. And number two, it says, when I see the blood, I shall pass over. So it is possible for death, looking for everybody, see some other people, and the death passes over because of what is on that person. Now, I mark you by the blood of Jesus. Amen. I mark your family. Amen. I mark your children. Amen. I mark your loved ones. Amen. I mark every citizen Amen. of Grace Nation Amen. by the blood of Jesus. Amen. I mark you. Amen. Death will see you and pass over. Amen. The barrier will not hold. Amen. The barrier will not hold. Amen. The barrier will not hold. Amen. Go and succeed. Now, from today as you go, don't limit him anymore. He's bigger than your idea. He's bigger than what you know. His ability is not your ability. His capability is not your capability. A man, I mean, the God who created heaven and earth for six days, who existed before anything existed, who came out, he came out of eternity into time. And they began to create anything that needs to be created. And the Bible said they are all made for his pleasure. And the Bible said he made them beautiful in their own times. I declare that the same God who made everything you are seeing today in six days. Within the remaining days of this month, may he give you a testimony that will shock you. Thank you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. As you go, the Lord will go with you. His grace will go with you. In the name of Jesus Christ. His goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Peace of the Lord be with you all. Go and have a wonderful uh, Good Friday celebration. See you on Sunday. Thank you.